Hello everyone, my name is John. Today, I will tell you how to set up uploading data from the Active Campaign CRM system to Google Contact. This is necessary to automatically transfer new deals from Active Campaign to other systems. For example, in Google Contact, create new contacts, each time a new transaction is added, it is convenient to store, process and interact with them in every possible way in the future. Now let's move on to the setup. First you need to create a new connection. Next, you need to select the Active Campaign Data Source System. Then you need to select an action Get New Deals. At this stage, you need to connect your Active Campaign account to the Apex Drive service. In this window, you must specify the API domain and API key. In order to get this data, you need to go to your Active Campaign account. Next, go to the Settings section. Next, go to the Developer section. Copy the URL and key and paste them into the appropriate fields in the Apex Drive system. When the required fields are filled, click Save. When the connected login is displayed in the list, select it and click Continue. In this case, there are no additional settings, so just click Continue. At this stage, you can set up a data filter, in this case there is no need for this, so we also click Continue. At this stage, you see test data for your active campaign deal. If everything suits you, click Next. This completes the setting of the active campaign data source successfully. Now you need to move on to setting up data reception. Choose Google Contact as the data receiving system. Next, you need to select an action, Create Contacts. At this stage, you need to connect your Google Contact account to the Apex Drive service. Enter your email and password. Give your permission to Apex Drive to work with your account. When the connected account is displayed in the list, select it and click Continue. Now you need to assign variables from the Active Campaign CRM system. In order to assign a variable, click on the field to which you need to transfer data and select the required variable from the drop down list. When all the necessary data is assigned, click Continue. At this stage, we see the test data that will be sent to Google Contact when creating a new deal. In order to check the correctness of the settings, click Send Test Data to Google Contact. If everything suits you, return to the Apex Drive service and continue setting up. On this, the data reception setup has been successfully completed, now you need to enable auto-update. Select the communication interval, for example once every 5 minutes. That's all, I wish you successful integration settings and good luck.